Little movement there by Leah Smith. You saw her right there in front of him in lane number two. They actually could have called that as a false start. I don't think they did. They will come back and look at it later on. But they, she did settle down and eventually got off cleanly. And talk about another Leah right next to her, just kind of beginning her career. 17, two Leahs, one maybe toward the end and one just kicking it in the gear. Leah Hayes, what a year she has had. You figure at some point you're going to have Aaliyah leading. <laughs> Leah Hayes trying to make her case early. Poplowski again, who had the best time in prelims with a new all-time mark for her, inching out in front there in lane four. Yeah, Poplowski doing a nice job, but just trying to stay right there with Leah Hayes and Gimmel in lane five. Keep an eye on Gimmel. She's got a lot of experience, still only 18, but she's got a lot of great experience on her belt. She can come back against this field. Trying to come from off the pace. She was second in this event at U.S. Nationals last summer. Second quick in the heats. But right now, Leah Hayes may be getting a boost from the hometown crowd here in Chicagoland, trying to win this race for the second year in a row. But Pavlowski battling back alongside in lane four. Boy, what a swim for both of these young swimmers right now. Pavlowski coming off a sixth-place finish just a few weeks ago at the NCAA championship. And you just had a huge PB this morning. Right now, Leah Hayes trying to race her. Her best time's 159. Once she was just off of that in the prelim. Yeah, only a couple of tenths off of her top time all time. Those two setting themselves up. And here Watch comes Gamble. Karen Gimmel in lane five. I was getting ready. Beat me to the punch. Watch Gimmel coming down the stretch. Here she comes. Pawlowski trying to hang on. Hayes to her right. Gimmel to her left. But Pawlowski to the wall first to grab the win here in Westmont. What a race to kick off tonight. Wins it by two tenths over Hayes. Gemmel about three and a half tenths there for third. Leah Smith coming home in four. Wow, what a charge by Gemmel. 29-9 on the end. The only swimmer to break 30 on the end. But Poplowski, what a, what a job she did to be able to hold off. I, you know, you don't want to say veterans at 17 and 18, but they've got a lot of experience. This 20-year-old's a real Deal. Talking about Leon Machan earlier, this this young lady right here at 40, at 20 years of age, again coming off that sixth place finish in the 200 yard freestyle. Yards and meters, big difference though. Ray Lewis there, the coach of Indiana. What a tremendous year he had with both the women's and the men's team. And you could see Hayes, and it paid off for Hayes. I, I, I said, regardless how it shakes out, she's going to have a great time. She did. She just went her best time right there by a second. So she just keeps charging on. That's a great swim for both of them. Here comes the charge by Gimmel. Not quite enough room. Runs out of room at the end. What a swim by Anna. And our winner is with us, new personal best as well for the second time today. Congratulations. We've been talking about changing from yards to meters. How challenging is it to get in the groove here at long course? Um, you know, it's definitely an adjustment, but, you know, it's nothing that we don't really prepare for. You know, like our training kind of helps us out for a short course and long course and just the adjustment made and being able to um, kind of take it like at hand. And it was such a great race to kick off the night. Could you get a sense where Aaron and Leah were being right next to you? <laughs> yeah, no, it was definitely great competitors and, you know, like, I train every day in practice as if like I'm training with the top dogs, you know, and it's it's definitely a surreal experience. Uh, congratulations. Thank you. Terrific win for Anna Poplowski. Thank you. Again, another personal best on this day for her. Leah Hayes right behind. Aaron Gemmel there in third. Leah Smith bringing it home in fourth. Izzy Ivy there in fifth. First final of the night here in the women's 200-meter freestyle.